Yo, what's up guys, it's Nuru. Today I have a great video for you guys, and hopefully you guys are all having a great day so far. And uh, pretty much, I just wanted to let you guys know before the video starts that I know this is split screen and I didn't know an online free-for-all match like I normally do. And that's because my Wi-Fi decided that it wanted to be gay and uh, not work. So, uh, as you can see, I, I have no friends online right now and I have no connection to my Wi-Fi at all. And then you also may be wondering, Nuru. How are you going to upload this video if there's no Wi-Fi? And then I figured it out that I'm going to put the file onto my phone and then upload it using my data. I pretty much have it all figured out. So now that we have the whole Wi-Fi split screen thing figured out, uh, let's get into today's topic. And today's topic is awkwardness. And you might be like, how do you come up with the topic of awkwardness? And this is just being around all my friends all the time. It's it's awkward they're awkward and I love them full so like being awkward sometimes it's like really it's really you know something so being awkward right you might be like wondering what I mean so think about this you know how I make my cut commentaries imagine a cut commentary without the cuts and not a normal commentary like with the cuts it would just be super delayed so for example here we go so today's topic is awkwardness If you're wondering why I chose the topic awkwardness, well then, you know, just finished watching the video, I guess. What the f- Okay, there we go. Just finished watching the video, I guess. So as you can see right there, it was it was already made pretty awkward by me. The, the host of this, not show, but the host of this little cut commentary YouTube channel thing that I have going on it was already pretty awkward just simply because of the fact I didn't cut the calm when I was supposed to cut the calm I just cut the calm whenever the calm you know was in desperate need of being cut because I made it awkward and then you guys might think like awkwardness is just being bad like awkwardness is actually pretty hilarious to me just think about all the awkward times that you've had with your friends you know just, just think about that like that this is just hilarious to some people and I find that super funny because, you know, I used to be one of those awkward people. But now I actually have a friend that is super awkward. So he kind of fulfills the role of our, like, little group. In every group, you realize that, you know, there's a stereotypical group in every group. That made no sense at all, but to me, it makes perfect sense. Like, for example, in every group, well, I'm not even going to say in every group, but in most groups, there's always, you know, the funny one, the one that, you know, gets all the girls, the one that just so happens to be the awkward one and then the one that actually is just in the group because he's black i am talking about black groups by the way i don't i don't talk to white people like that i mean i do but i don't not in real life i'm pretty sure there's billions of white people that i talk to online every day but you know in real life it's it's mainly black people no offense, I mean, white people are really cool. It's just, you know, I, I don't see a lot of them all the time. So, since I don't see them, I really don't have the opportunity to speak to them. That should have been a clad. But anyway, like I was saying, oh, my, I can't kill anybody. So anyway, like I was saying about the stereotypical groups, it's pretty much, you know, like that. There's always the awkward one. And in every group, there is an awkward one. So you can't say, oh, there's no awkward one. If there is no awkward one, that means you're the awkward. I'm sorry to break it to you, but that's just the truth. If you don't know the awkward one in your group, that makes you the awkward. If you don't know the funny one in your group, that makes you the funny one. And it's pretty much obvious, you know, to know if you're the awkward one or the funny one or the one that's just in the group because, you know, you're black. I have a lot of people in my little clique just because they're black. Mainly two people. I'm not going to say any names, but yeah. Like the guy that was in my video the other day, Elmo, you guys may know him as Elmo. In my little group, because I know him at IRL, he's the awkward. He's the one that's, you know, kind of scared of girls, but not really scared of girls. He's probably going to leave a comment that says, I'm not scared of girls with a straight face. Uh, I've known him for so long, I can pretty much predict anything that he's going to do. But, yeah, that's pretty much what that is. Before I actually finish off the topic and, you know, today's video and stuff, I just want to let you guys know that if you follow me on Twitter, you might know that I said I'm probably going to become a BO1 player just for a little while, not like for the rest of my whole YouTube career like Paco or anything like that. I based my channel just off Black Ops 1, but maybe for like a little bit longer, just for like a two weeks, maybe three weeks, uh, just because Black Ops 2 is just so like 
dead right now. Like, everybody's been playing that game for three years, and almost every YouTuber has even said that the game is boring themselves. So I'm probably just going to play, you know, BO1 like I said I'm going to. And yeah, I'm probably just going to play this game for about two weeks until this game gets boring. And then I'm just going to go back to BO2 like everyone else. Because right now, this game is just super fun to me. Like, the trick shotting on this game is fun, even though you can barely trick shot on this game. But everything is just comes together in this game. It's like, this is the original OD OG COD. A lot of people would say, like, MW2 is, but this game kind of, you know, is like really i don't really know how to explain like the quick scoping in this game is really smooth like just the way you aim in and then yy and then aim in it's just really smooth the only thing that's like hurts me so much is the hitbox is so messed up in this game like the hitbox is horrible and as a perfect example watch this okay that was that was a bad shot but i'm gonna i'm gonna do a shot that's gonna be like right on and i'm not gonna get a hit marker i'm not gonna get a kill i'm gonna show you guys just just wait for it it's gonna come up soon just wait for it there we go. There we go. I'm gonna slow mo this. I'm gonna slow mo that. Just so you guys can understand how messed up this hitbox is. There we go. That, that was another one. I, I shot him clearly in his kneecap, and I didn't get a hit marker or anything. So pretty much, guys, that's all for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this little awkward topic thing. And uh, I am going to start uploading a little bit more just because I have a little bit more time on my hands. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and a comment below. And it's been Naru. Peace. Hey, I, I got the kill, and then I, like, synced it with the piece, so now I'm gonna have a complete video. It, it's just gonna look beautiful, man. Oh, my gosh. Look at me stepping up in this COD community, big boy Naru over here. <laughs> but, yeah, anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Wait, oh, I have I'm one more until I'm off last. I'm one more until I'm off last. All right, so I'm just gonna get, like, one more kill before I end the video. Get one more kill, and then I'm gonna go for a shot. Okay, here we go. I'm at last. Alright, I'm gonna show you guys, like, what's the best spot to go for a trick shot on this map. Especially if you're, like, going against bots because your Wi-Fi is gay. This is, like, the legit best spot. And then, like, people would, like... Ah! Ah! Not only did I missed the trick shot with the barrel stuff but i also hit marked the guy after i reached is my coat oh it, it does show see how accurate they are look at me stepping up in this community trick shotting and whatnot let's go let's go